What's up guys, PBD here and welcome back to another episode of Duck Life 9, The Flock. We are pretty much done with the game, but we still have a few things to do before we completely end the series. But before we get into what's left to do, we have to talk about our daily dose of Duck Life 9. So, first thing to address, it looks like people are having some issues with the game. Uh, there seems to be a few bugs here and there. And I think I am the victim of one of those bugs, unfortunately. So, if you guys recall, I am missing three coins in, what was it? Uh, Sunflower Ravine, I believe it's what it's called. Over here. I'm missing three coins. I looked all over for these coins. I even watched uh, someone play the game. And, yeah, I can't find the coins. So... I looked it up and I, to see if uh, any other people are having this issue and it looks like some people are having this issue and it seems like it's a bug with the game. So unfortunately there's nothing I can do to get those coins at the moment. I'm hoping that maybe in the future uh, they fix it and we can get those coins because unfortunately by not being able to get those coins we can't 100% the game which is actually something I really would like to do and one of the reasons I would like to do 100% uh, completion is because one I'm a completionist when it comes to games, but two We're only missing three trophies in The museum not not the school. I went into the school thinking it was a museum We're only missing three museum three uh, trophies in this museum Over here as you can see I'll show you we got this one that we're missing this one and this one So I don't know which one's which but I did take a look at what the achievements were one of them is to get or to climb 250 meters in the beginner training. So we're actually going to try and do that this episode. I feel like we should be able to do that. The other one is completing the cookbook, like cooking everything that's in the cookbook. Uh, we, we should be able to do that as well today. Um, maybe not depending on how many days or radishes we have. And then the last one is getting 100% completion in the game, which unfortunately we can't do because we're missing the coins. So we're kind of stuck there. Other, our other piece of duck, um, the dose of Duck Life 9 is that uh, Ryan com re recommended that I go ahead and make a t shirt for every single duck in the flock who's been along the journey with us since the beginning of the game. Well, maybe not since the beginning of the game because we have a lot of ducks join along the way. Make a custom shirt for each of those ducks with their name on it, and that is exactly what I did. Uh, you can't really see it that well. Um, over here, but I went ahead made a shirt for Igor made a shirt for Tenzing and they all have their names on it one for Gareth one for Walter one for Erica and I didn't make one for Pip because I do like the spider-man shirt that I made for him And I didn't make one for these ducks because they we we didn't really use these ducks at all And they also joined very late. So I just went with like the OGs Igor well Igor was probably uh, one of the ducks we recruited I think like uh midway through the game but Tenzin, Gareth, Walter, and Erica were definitely some of the OG ducks that we uh, recruited to the flock so they deserve the shirt and that is what I went ahead and did for them anyways we are now ready to get into it we have to go and explore that cave but uh, yeah I'm a little bummed out that um that we can't get those coins so anyways we get this task done over here for the smuggler we won the Cloud Kingdom tournament, so we can go ahead and claim that as well. Uh, make a poolside party platter. That's probably one of the recipes. Fill 15 pages. Upgrade a house into a fancy house. Interesting. Okay, so we can build an arcade. That's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and do that. I wanted to put it right next to the training. But it doesn't look like we'll be able to do that because we don't have any space. <laughs> we. I really thought that at some point they would give us more space unfortunately they didn't so everything looks pretty crowded here i'm just gonna have to put it like right here i guess i don't know uh what else what else is there to do so to upgrade a house into a fancy house what are we missing oh we have to first we have to do a, a wood house okay there we go pip's house is now a wood house can we upgrade it to a Wait. A fancy tent? 
Oh, we never upgraded to a fancy tent. That explains it. <laughs> Alright, uh, we'll give Gareth a fancy tent. And does that let us now make a fancy house? Yeah. Alright, and we'll give it to Pip. <laughs> Alright, that's one of the tasks done. Alright. How many tasks does this guy have? Because I feel like we've done so many. Click 10 trophies in the museum, we've done that. What else is there? Unlock all pro training games, we've done that. Completely fill your cookbook. Okay, so let, we could try and do that right now. Hold on, let me... um. I think my mouse is on low battery. I gotta plug it in there. All right. Oh, I also forgot to set the timer. So much going on today. Let me just do that really quick. There we go. All right, where were we? We were gonna do the cookbook. Okay, so what are we missing in the cookbook? I think we've only got a few recipes left, honestly. Let's see, let's see. So we've made that, we made that. What are we missing here? I've grown a few daisy radishes since the last episode, so. Okay, we need two watermelons, a beetroot, and the flower. What was it? Uh, two watermelons, beetroot, and was it this flower? Yeah, I think it was. All right, what does that make now? A sweet fondue. Let's give it to one of these ducks was starving. I forgot who it was. I think it was Igor. We'll give it to him. All right, what else is there before we go out to the cave and explore what is in there? Okay, two of the blue fish, a beetroot, and a flower. Two of this fish right here, a lunker beetroot or duck root should I say and what was it the flower it was this one right <coughs> excuse me had a sneeze all right we'll give this to pip all right how many do we have left of these that's not the platter we need right it's a different one I think Oh my god, there is a lot of recipes. Oh, there's only four left, actually. Okay. One of each fish. Do we even have that red fish? I don't think we do. And then two of the green, one duck root, one red, one blue fish. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to remember what it was. You know what? Let's just do the fish one. No. How do I cancel it out? Alright, it was one of each fish, right? Oh, I can't get rid of this. There. One of each fish, we have that. Oh, was it like that? Or, mm, okay. <laughs> There's too many ingredients I'm forgetting. I forgot what fish it was. Hold on. Wait, there it was. It was the two blue ones, the purple one, and the red one. Yeah, so I put a wrong fish in there. It was the blue one. Oh, we've only got one of those. What does that make? I wonder what happens if you put in the wrong ingredients. Like, what does that make? Seafood surprise. Right, let's give it to Igor. Okay, so we don't have any more of the... We might have to go fishing for that. If we want to cook that last recipe I don't know you guys are probably excited to go to the cave we'll just do that in a second here okay what was it two two radishes a beetroot a duck root a flower and a blue fish the flower and the blue fish the lunker right we still haven't made that pie, have we? Dazed duck delight. What the heck? Right, let's give it to Gareth. All right. Can we cook um, one of the last ones? I think it requires that fish we're missing, so we might have to do that later. Yeah. Oh, they both require. So we need three of that red fish if you want to complete the cookbook. Okay. So we'll go fishing later to try and do that. But for now, I think we are good to go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We have another task done here. 
collect 15 trophies, did that. Oh, and those are the last two tasks. Perfect. Right, what's in the well? Let's upgrade. We can upgrade the jelly coin machine. Not sure. Oh, it gives us better prizes. I mean, I don't really know if we have any coins left, but let's go out and and uh, see what's up with that cave. So it wasn't in the volcano interior, was it? It was volcano town. All right, let's see what is up in this cave. I think we have to switch to the fire duck, right? Oh, okay. We already have him selected. Perfect, 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 perfect. All right, let's see. So this cave was actually part of an update that came out not too long ago. So uh, good thing we didn't really finish the game that quick because we would have had to wait. <laughs> now we can just go straight into it. All right, what what is in this cave? Raw. All right, we already had this conversation. Just let me in. Please make yourself at home in my cave. But do not be disheartened. The challenges within prove insurmountable. We got a cutscene. What the heck? Welcome to Drake's Cave. Gordon's Gauntlet. Challenge all seven of us to a one-on-one -on -one race. What the heck? Defeat us all to overcome Gordon's Gauntlet. Okay, what the heck? So it's like a race for each one? Interesting. Alright. I think it always puts our best duck at the top for like the specific race. So we'll go with Gareth here. Race 2. Ooh. We'll use Igor. Race 3, we'll use Pip. I haven't really done any training, so hopefully I don't need it. Gordo. <laughs> that actually means fat in Spanish, which is kind of funny. Uh, Chef Gordon. Uh, you know, we all know who that is. Gordon Ramsay, of course. We'll use Erica there. Sir Gordington. Tenzing. Oh, so we get to use every duck after we just made the shirts. I think that's pretty cool. And Gordette, we will use the fire duck. All right, let's see if we can win all seven of these races, but uh, I don't know how I feel. So we get to see them wear their shirts during the race, which is pretty nice. Gareth wearing his uh, pink. Okay. I didn't even see the stats, actually, of uh, the Ducks were racing. Okay, this looks like a pretty short race, and Gareth is in the lead, so good start. I wonder if we get anything for winning these races. You've defeated the first Gordon. Only six left to outrace. All right, now we got Igor. Oh, to get back to what did he say? Oh, okay, we might need to cheer here. For uh... okay, this is not looking good for Igor. I don't like the look of this, man. Yeah, we lost. Oh, that's annoying, man. That is annoying. I, 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 that makes me think that we're gonna lose the other ones as well. Oh, my God. Wait, what? It automatically kicks me out if I lose? <laughs> oh no. Okay, I guess that means we have to do some training. Ah, oh, that's so annoying. I thought we were done with training in this game. Okay. You know what we'll do? Let's go ahead and... Let's go catch some of that fish that we need. Because... I want to finish the cookbook. This episode. And you know what? We'll actually... Wait, what? Carpenter duck? Oh, hello there, friend. I couldn't help but notice that your fishing beach was looking a little empty. So I put my carpentry skills to work and built you a nice pier. Awesome. Ah yes, I'm rather happy with it myself, I must say. From that pier you'll be able to reach even further out to sea. Who knows, there might even be some new types of fish out there. Thank you. No problem at all. Well, enjoy it now. I will. Oh, wow. So we gotta... 
more ocean to fish in, I guess. So, the thing that's kind of annoying about fishing is that, like, you don't know which duck you can get. So, it might take you, like, forever to get the, the duck you want. Not the duck, the, the fish you want. See, like, right there we got... At least we got three, so maybe if we catch one of the red ones, they'll give us three, and we'll be at, we'll be done. Um, let's go to this pier actually to see. Oh, there's a red one. Come on, give me three. Give me three. Three. Perfect. Alright, now we can just head back. Wow, that was way quicker than I thought it would be. Um, I didn't want to swap duck. I want to travel back to the flock. Alright, now we should be able to finish the cookbook, which is nice. And you know what we could do as well? We can try that training uh, trophy that I wanted to try. Jelly coin machine, get another upgrade. The thing is, we don't have any jelly coins, and I'm not sure if we're going to get any more since we finished the game. Um, what was going to do? Oh, yeah, the cookbook. Let's go do that. Okay, what was the recipe again? I should really probably take a picture of these things so I don't keep forgetting them. Okay, two red, the little tomato things, the watermelon, and a daisy radish. Watermelon, little tomato thingy, seed spice, and what was it? A daisy radish. Oh, cook all the recipes in the cookbook. There you go. We didn't even have to make the last one for some reason. Hmm, I wonder why. But we didn't, we never made the pie, did we? The last one's probably the pie, right? Like it has to be. Oh wait, we did make a pie. Wow. Okay, what's this last one then? One redfish, two of the bluefish, and two of the watermelon looking thing. One of the redfish, two of the bluefish, two of the watermelon thingy. What does that make? That makes it. Is that the platter? Yes, poolside party platter. Love that. Let's give it to Erica. Alright. So, that is another trophy in the museum. Now we're just missing the, uh, that's all the tasks done as well. Now we're just missing the 100% of the game and the 250 meters in, um, uh, so he doesn't really sign anything that cool that I would need. Like, if I really wanted to, we could spend all our coins on, like, coffees and... Uh, apples and maybe like force our way through winning the races but I don't know if I want to do that okay so if I remember correctly it was 250 meters in climbing I hope I hope it's that thing the problem with this is that you don't know how many meters you've cl climbed but apparently I got to 222 was the farthest I've gotten. Oh, we can actually try out that arcade that we built as well. I haven't tried that out. Oh, so that's 25 meters right there. I guess it does tell you then. Alright, let's try and get these, uh, what was it, 250 in one go. I remember when I used to do this training, I, it was pretty easy. And the only time I really lost was because I just gave up on purpose because it was just taking forever and you don't you never really die and this all right uh, let's go up here okay so what are we at like 75 meters right there so like, I'd say we're a quarter of the way there no I died look I was just saying it's it's so easy and I just died okay you know what We'll give it one more go. And so you guys just don't see me trying this a million times. 
If I lose, I'll, uh... I'll just do it on my own. Okay, that's 50. No! I didn't realize those rocks break. Oh my god, that makes it a little bit tougher then. And I missed. Okay, screw this. I'll do it by myself. Alright, what were we going to do? We were going to um, try the arcade out. Let's see what's in the arcade. Where did I build it? I built it like right over here, right? Enter. Running, swimming. Wait, what is this? Play running. Wait. Oh, you get a you get a trophy. Huh. But what is this? This count right here. Wait, what? And there's like a secret one. I wonder what that is, that count. So this is just basically all the um, all the training courses that we did. I'm just going to do one to see what it's like. So 88 gets this bronze. I get, oh, I almost fell off right there because I wasn't paying attention. I remember, I think it was in the previous Duck Life, the... Um, the trophies for like the training was so hard. I think I've said this already before, but it was like crazy to me how hard it was considering it was a kid's game and like I couldn't even do it. Alright, so we got bronze. I mean, this one shouldn't be too hard to get gold. But I don't really know if I want to get gold <laughs> in everything because like, what's the point really? At least with the, the other trophies, they go into the museum and you can, like, look at them. This, as far as I can tell, isn't... Although I do want to kind of unlock to see what that secret thing is. But I don't know how you unlock it. Do you have to get gold in everything? Do you have to get bronze in everything? Okay, so we got silver and we're on our way to gold. So long as we don't die here. Oh, there you go. Oh, wait. No, that was for silver. Okay. Oh, God. It's getting harder. Okay, well, wait, what? There's another one? It's just like blue? I mean, do we have it already? It should end as soon as you get like the... <laughs> the hardest one. Oh my god, what is this, dude? I think this is the furthest I've gotten in this... <laughs> ever because I don't remember lasting this long in a all right I think I'm just gonna lose on purpose here because I'm pretty sure we got a maximum trophy that we can get so I'm just gonna get to the end here and then and die but it is interesting 
The funny thing is that I, I'm gonna have to do this again for the training. <laughs> for those races in the cave. If I wanna... Alright, you know what? Let's just lose. I'm tired of this. What do we get? We get the trophies, which is nice. But like... What do we get actually from this? I don't I really understand what you have to do. Like it doesn't tell you anything either. Anyways. Um yeah, so I guess all that's left really is to We don't have any coins, right? Let me just make sure. I guess all that's left is to train and enter those races. Yeah, we don't have any more jelly coins. I think I might save that for the next episode, though. So we can end off things there. I'll also have to uh, do that 250 meters for next episode as well. But I think other than that, we're pretty much done with the game, guys. I'm not sure actually what happens after you win that race in the cave, so maybe there's more. But the way things are looking, next episode might be the last one. But uh, for today, we're going to end things here. might be a little bit of a shorter episode today. Just because we have to do that training. It's kind of annoying. But it is what it is. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Duck Life 9 The Flock. Next episode, we will win the Gordon Gauntlet or whatever it's called. But thank you so much for watching. My name is Pippi Deed. And I'm out.